Hello everyone and welcome back to Hoko Live. My name is Melanie P. It is now Thursday the 23rd of spring and we will head outside. And it is a rainy spring day. So we don't have to water our crops today, but we do have to see if there's any ready for harvesting. Over to the farm we'll go. Okay, let's see what we've got today. And we've got some cabbages. Let's go ahead and pick all of these. So we've got seven days left in this season. We'll have to see if there's anything we can plant that will be ready in seven days. And there's some asparagus too. I'll collect all of this. Okay, let's get the other side. More cabbages and asparagus. Okay, so we'll have to see what kind of seeds we can purchase from Aubrey. If we can find Aubrey, that is. Aubrey, where are you hiding? Aubrey moves around the farm so quickly. Here he is. Hey, Aubrey. The crops are going to do well in this weather. Okay, so... We can do more asparagus, it's a 7 day crop, or we can do some broccoli, no, that's 10 days, Brussels sprouts, no, no cabbage, no carrots, we would love to do more pineapple, but that's 13 days, and onions, I guess we can do onions, because onions will go into the next season. We can do potatoes as well. Oh, we can do rhubarb. Let's do all the rhubarb. <laughs> oh, and strawberries. Mm, strawberries will go into the next season. We'll do rhubarb. Yeah, I think we can definitely benefit from having a lot of extra rhubarb. We can plant strawberries next season. Let's get 30 sets. Okay, planting some rhubarb. Spot there. Rhubarb's all done. Okay, let's get over to the town center. Actually, I need to go up to the mountains. Because I always forget I have the uh, trees up there. I don't think I've collected any trees all season long. 
suppose I should have gone to the mountain top instead. That's okay, we can run up there. Okay, let's see what trees we have. We've got lemon trees that are ready. And orange trees as well. Okay, and there should be one more back here. Did I get them all? No. <laughs> it's kind of hard to tell which ones have been taken. There we go, I got all the oranges. And it looks like we got some cherries ready too. Maybe not. Okay, no cherries. But let's collect the rest of the oranges. And the lemon. Okay, now we can go into town. Now, oh, and there is a couple of requests on the notice board. Benny wants five times eight, and Kitty wants your exterior done. And what do we have in here? Got some silver and chalk. We'll take both. And let's say hello to Nico. Hey Nico. One time, this delivery truck for a candy factory crashed near my place. No one was hurt, but there was candy everywhere. That was rad. Okay, so I was supposed to give the screen page to Oleander a while ago, but I forgot, and now it's gone so long, it's embarrassing. Can you deliver it for me? Sure. I can do that. And let's see what Moss's shop has for today. Hopefully something new. Okay, a four-standing mirror. That is not new. I think the small blue tile floor might be new though. And I've definitely got newspaper stacks before and a notepad. Okay, right now I need to buy some glue. I'm starting to run a bit low. I'll buy a bunch. It's gonna be pricey. we go and might as well get some of the fabric dye base. I don't need as many as this though. Or maybe I do. I don't remember. Let's get like 70. And I think I had an order for Oma. Three strawberries and three rhubarb. We can get that delivered. Hello, Oma. Okay, here you go. Three strawberries and three rhubarb. Ah, perfect timing. Thank you, Melody B. You're welcome. We've got some pink straps to go on.
Okay, I'm gonna sell some of the stuff I have from Moth. Hey Moth, I'm back again. Um... We can sell the cabbage. I got tons of oranges. Here can go. Lemon stew, peaches, sure. And the shoes I'll sell. I'll hang on to the wood and some leaf plum. I don't even know where I got half of this stuff from. Okay, let's see if we can do any deliveries today. So, Tola wants perch. Those fish are hard to find. Um, Sheriff sure, wants yellow fabric to item eight. We can do that. If any wants plies, I think I might have that many plies available. We have a delivery for Oleander. Tola wants an orange paint. Uh, Ruby needs 13 green paint. <laughs> My goodness, Ruby, what do you plan on doing with all that paint? Okay, let's see who's on this map. Okay, we don't have any deliveries for here. I'm trying the meadow. Okay, nobody is outside here. Well, maybe we can find Oleander and pull that home. Okay, where's Oleander's house? It's all the way to the back. And Pola is back there as well. Kinda. Hey, Tola. Spring puts me in such a fantastic mood. I feel like I'm waking up after the winter. Okay, here is one orange paint for you. Oh, we got a watermelon skirt in return. And at some point, I'm gonna fix up Tola's house. Tola, I think you're next. I'm gonna get your nice house. Okay, now we need to find Oleander. There is this house. Hey, Oleander. I don't agree with Nami about many things, but we're definitely on the same page about you. I don't know what to make of that. So, here is your green paint. Oh my, I completely forgot about this. I'll be sure to thank you later. And we got a quarter to him black and white pants. Let's see what we can do for Oleander. I told Smurf they would never be able to catch a rare fish without a white carpet guy. Okay. We'll take that to Smurf.
And let's get back over to the seaside. Okay, sure, brilliant. There's are on this map. Sure, want some yellow fabric dye times eight. Maybe we can do that. But I might have some fish in here. Yes, I definitely have enough of the bite. So we'll be able to get that penny after. But let's go see about getting sure his fabric guy. So yellow fabric guys, probably gonna use yellow petals and some fabric dye base, so let's make sure here. Uh, yep, so two and one. So how much do we need again? Uh, eight. We've got 16 of the petals. And we also got some space in our backpack already. And we might as well make the order that Ruby wanted. The so green paint times 13. I think it needs green leaves. Needs 13, so let's get 20 set. Hopefully that's what we need. <laughs> green paint. Uh, yeah. Done. So we'll go see the strip is actually outside right now. It was before. Still here. Hey, Sheriff. Hello there, Melanie V. How lovely to see you. This is for you. Thank you so much, Melanie V. Here's a white flat shoe as something in return. Okay, so I think we should probably head to bed. We'll sleep till tomorrow. And it's now Friday the 24th of spring. Now today I kind of want to go over to the island. I haven't searched for artifacts in some time. But I've got a lot of stuff. I don't need to carry around. Let's go put the clothing away, actually. Uh, and shoes can go in here.
Okay, and let's put some stuff away. I can go there. These can go in here. And so can this. In you go. And we'll put the weak lumps in there. Okay, I think that's pretty much all we can get rid of. Okay, let's take a trip to the island. I mostly just want to find some of you out of back. Hey, Hurley. To the island, please. Okay. So, as always, there's lots of stuff to chop down. And lots of resources to gather. Let me take some of those. And let's see here if we can't find some new artifacts. Probably a lot easier to find stuff when there, there's nothing in the way, no trees. Okay, so far nothing. This one looks pretty easy. And it's just a geode. Oh, did I see something here? Another geode. Oh, there's something here. Am I only gonna find geodes today? Oh, no, think about piece number one. That is one I think I've already gotten. one is tricky. Finally. Inkable piece four. I don't know if I'm missing any of those pieces. That might be one that's already completed. But we'll continue our search. Well, we're certainly finding a lot of driftwood. Oh, this one is tiny. Yeah, a 
Greek Gaelic Creator piece. That is definitely gotta be new. That one was super hard. Just another geode. Probably. No, it's Inca bottle piece number two. I don't know if I have that. Inca bottle piece number two. Another deal. Not that exciting. Climb up the mountain. Ooh, this one's tough. Oh no, I missed it. Oh, there's another one. Way easier. But it's a deal. Well, that might be all we're going to find for today. Oh, we got some new pieces at least. So, we'll put this artifact detector away. Let's see what we can donate. Hey, Leonard. Uh, let's try. Think of old piece number one. I feel like I've donated those before, though. Let's go with the Greek reader piece. Yeah, that's definitely new. And the ink a bottle piece. I've already donated this. No. Let's double check the bowl pieces. Yep, that one's done. And number four. That's not new. Okay, so the Inca bowl is completed. The Inca bottle is also completed. I wonder how many pieces are left in this set. There's probably some more Egyptian pieces. And I definitely know there is more Greek pieces to be found. That oil jar is not complete. The Gaelic crater. I'm not even sure what that is. And the Greek M4 is not done as well. So yeah, there's definitely a few pieces left to go. I think the pirate ones might be done. There might be one more. Who knows? I guess we will just have to wait and see. Okay, well, I'm going to go ahead and collect all of the goodies over here. 
But I think that's going to be it for today's episode. Thank you very much for watching.